are on that trail that I've been talking about. We had to postpone it a few times uh, because of weather. It was really slippery because we are going to be going always uphill, guys. So uh, those are our markers. If you can see right there, it's red and white. Hold on, let me zoom in for you. Uh, where is it? There they are. Those are our markers. And there's my daughter. She's already ahead of me. There she is. So somewhere behind that tree. But I won't be... Uh, I won't be recording much until we get onto a flatter piece of land. But we do have already number one obstacle and it's a couple of broken trees, fallen trees. Yeah. Watch you don't get hurt. We could even go that way and then... Yeah. So, obstacle number one. There's another tree that fell over that way. But I am excited because we're going to Cap 360, and uh, are you good? Will you be able to get over that? Uh, will I be able to go over that tree? I should be able to. You know, we could go this way too. I mean, I'll just have to pull up my leg a little higher. All right, geez. And we can go this yeah, way. and this way. So I'm going to try and find some nice spots for you. So you can see what this section looks like. It's the first time we're doing it. We found a chanterelle already. We already found a mushroom, which is a good thing. But as you can see, everything is uphill. A lot of fallen trees. So we're going to see what, how much we can do today. Hopefully we could get to the 360. But I am sure this place is going to be a workout for us. But I'm excited. Lots of climbing. Everything is uphill, guys. Beautiful. Hey. Eh? A lot of fallen trees, yeah. Wow. We have to go up there. So, I'll see you in a bit, guys. And I'll show you some nice spots. <laughs> yeah. Our bodies are strong, but it takes the air out of you. But we're going to do this slowly. Plus, it's very hot. Hey, Erica. It's really hot today. I, that way. So the markings are great. So I'm going to put you away, guys, until we got to go all the way up there. So I don't want to fall, but I'll show you what it looks like later. Wow, what a workout. We're basically walking on these dry pine needles, a little slippery, but so beautiful. We came all the way, I'm not sure if you can see it, from down there. And my daughter has been picking up chanterelles for us. This is a win-win. Eh? The markings are great. But it takes your lungs away. Yeah, I'm trying to. Whatever, chicken, chanterelles. Nice big cliff that way. Eh? I don't know. But this is so beautiful. Wow. Bolites? Hold on, I want to, I want them to see it. Wow, this is like the mushroom, uh, mushroom heaven. Mushroom heaven. Look. Look. Oh, wow, look Virginia. at that. Beautiful. Can I show them close Do up? Do you have yeah. your knife? Here you go. You want to hold the knife yourself? Ooh. Look at that, guys. Mushroom heaven. And remember guys, oh, if you're going to take mushrooms, you cut it. You don't rip out anything. You don't want to disturb the mycelium. Look how beautiful. Oh, look at that. Let me zoom out. 
Oh my goodness. That is a beauty. It's perfect. Thank no you, worms, universe. Nothing. In my bag. We're gonna leave this uh, hike with uh, with goodness. So anyhow, we're we're going that way, guys. We keep going up. So I'm shutting this off because I don't want to take a chance and fall. Look at these little red. But leave them. Let them grow. I just want to see. So we are going up more. Okay, guys. I don't want to fall, so I am going to turn you off until the next spot. Just want to show you how beautiful it is. And we're just going up, up, up. Eh? No more pine needles. Yeah, those pine needles are slippery. Okay, Erica, wait for me. I'm coming, babe. Wow. I can't believe how beautiful this place is. This place is nicer than when we were at Mont Tremblant. It really is. And the markings are great. The markings are, are red and white flags. I don't know if you can see them. But really beautiful. And I don't know if you want to see this. Is my bag I have hanging off my shirt. Thank God for Columbia shirts, eh? I'm freaking wet. My whole body is wet. I know. What the heck? This is so beautiful. But everything is up. We go up, guys. But if we make it to our destination, which is only a part part of a trail, if we make it to our destination, uh, we're going to be what they call the Cap 360. And we're going to be able to see the most beautiful view because you can see 360 degrees. There's a, a sign there. But it is simply amazing over here. Oh, look at the lake, how nice it looks from up here. Wow. I'm not sure if you can see it. I'm going to try and zoom in for you guys because we're pretty high already. Uh, there's the highways and there's a the beautiful river. Red River. La Riviere Rouge. And uh, yeah, that's the little LaBelle town that we're at. And markings everywhere. They're so clearly marked. Markings for when we head back. Beautiful. I am so impressed by this trail. We, we didn't do it a couple of times because of rain. We're supposed to rain again today too. Look, Erica. Oh, there you go. Mushrooms, but they... These are what? Rizula? Those are Rizulas, I think. Yeah, we're not going to pick the Rizulas. Yeah, the Rizulas, unfortunately, is not a mushroom we could pick because by the time we get home, there won't be any mushroom left. But there has an abundance of mushrooms already. Seek and you shall find. But we are climbing a mountain. I'm not even sure how high it is. It's not a very high mountain, but still, what a workout. It takes the wind out of you. But it's so beautiful. But yeah, if we get to the 360, we'll be able to see all around us. And then we could continue with the gorilla section. We're not ready for that, are we? Is it the gorilla section, Erica? The other part of it? Yeah. Wow. What beautiful views. Look at that. It is amazing. If anybody wants to feel like part of nature, pick up hiking, guys. Water. Fire. Yeah. Wow. How beautiful is this, guys? I just want to show you. Ooh. How beautiful is it? There is 
the beautiful Red River and it's red because the clay is red and the sand and it reflects uh, there's days where it looks like blood river but it is beautiful hi Erica Hello. are you happy you came yes yeah. yeah, somebody made a fire yeah okay guys let's keep going uh, we're going into the bush now We're going up again. Up, up, up. Nice little drop. Hey? Watch your step those rocks poking out of the ground. Yeah, I see it. Thank you, Erica. And these are all blueberries. Look, guys. Oh, look. look. Yeah. Blueberries. Yeah, blueberries everywhere. They're not ready yet. There's a few that are ready. Pop one in my mouth. <clears throat> oh, they're not that ready. Oh. They're good. Here. Okay, drop them. Mm. So good. Blueberries everywhere. Look for ripe ones. Ripe ones. Yeah. Oh Next God, week they'll be ripe. And you're wearing a t-shirt. Yes, I put on my Columbia shirt because I figured if there's any bugs, they would have to bite through that first. At least save some of my body. Because these, these black flies, man, they're not very nice. I mean, they take chunks off of you. Wow, the trail is so nicely done. Eh? Beautiful. Oh my God, I wish my grandkids were here too. They'd be able to do this trail, eh, Erica? Eh? For sure they can climb this. Look for uh, Chantrell's baby girl. Because we're going to be cooking those up tonight. You know, usually we come up here and we always stop in Mont Tremblant to uh, do a small grocery so we don't have to drag in a lot of food with us in the car and put and have more space for our gear and stuff. And uh, oh, here's a little mushroom. And uh, we even did, we did buy this kind of like big bag that you throw on top of the hood of your truck. Look, Erica. I saw. Um, to put extra load, but my husband hates putting it together, so. He kind of says, don't worry, I'll make things fit. But we always do our shopping up here. And we still have to jam the stuff inside our... Inside our car. Our uh, Jeep. Oh, it's so beautiful. It's like, really... This place is making me happy. I am happy. Oh, wow. Really, really nice. So, mushrooms everywhere, Erica. I see some over there, but I'm not going to start climbing to the other side. Look for uh, oyster, Erica. I'm sure there's oysters up here. Maybe if we're lucky, we'll even find some chicken. And when we say chicken, guys, we're talking chicken of the woods. Not oh, chicken oh, with eyes and a heartbeat. I have a spot for my phone in my pants. You do, yes. Are you good? Can you grab my hose? Can you grab my uh, my bladder and flip it over to the front? Do you know where it is? Yeah, tuck it under here. Perfect. There we go. I need to drink. Sorry. Yeah. Are you talking? No, I'm just Okay. That was good. Yeah, I wore my Columbia shirt today. I have the sleeves rolled up, but dang, is it hot. My face is completely drenched, and I don't sweat. I'm not a sweaty person. This place makes me happy, Erica. It's so beautiful.
You know what I need you to get me? If you're... Very beautiful in here. Okay, guys. I need to put my bandana, my, uh, my buffer on my neck so I could pull it up and wipe the sweat off my face when I need it. So, I'll see you in a bit, guys. Hey, guys. And when I tell you, I mean, you guys should. A any of you who love hiking or in Montreal, come up to La Belle and do the Cat 360. It is one of the most beautiful trails ever. Really, really beautiful. Well, well kept, well marked. And we found one of the markings that were on the floor. We put it back up so that whoever comes after us. Oh, oh no, those are those other ones. Yeah. And we're finding mushrooms. That's the best part. See that there? is a rosula but rosula i mean they're delicious if you find them um they break very easily so if you're ever going to pick rosulas i say bring a basket and lay them down flat so they don't break on you and some mosquito bit me on the inside of my leg dang and i sprayed myself Beautiful. The trail is simply, simply magical, majestic, beautiful. So I know we're going to be hitting some massive uphill because after we did all that uphill, we're going up and down now. There's another little mushroom, but... I don't want to pick any that are going to break. I know the chanterelles don't break. And if we find any nice oyster, those should be... Oh, we only did one kilometer. <laughs> That's slow and steady, right? Mm -hmm. Well, when you know, don't know it. You know what's good, Erica? Mm. If we come and do this again... I'm sorry, guys. I have to scratch the inside of my leg. Something took a nice bite. Um, and we're light packing it today, so we have our light, our light packs. We did bring our it's poles because you really need your poles. Yeah, you're not logging all that weight on our back. So we're doing some light packing. We have some light lunches. We only did one kilometer, eh? Okay. But, uh, yeah, we have a long ways to go, but you know what? I think we're going to be able to make it but if we, if not for whatever reason if it starts raining because we're supposed to get some severe uh, i'm going to start walking down erica we're supposed to get some severe oh look erica into the mud pit i go uh there's the trail over there um yeah, this is so much better than tromblon like, oh my god it so is much, eh? like well they didn't call tram a uh, tram they didn't call that sec section the devil sector for no reason that was like, you know, yeah, come like to hell. Besides that, like, the... It's not like, not like... This is still difficult. Well, difficult. It's nice. It's not uh, hard. Or is that a belief? Or is that a belief? No, belief. But, um... It's just nicely marked. That's what it is. And cleaner. Look, these are the ones that stop you from having a... A, a trip. Yeah, if you're if ever doing... If you have, doing... like, a psychedelic mushroom, these stop you, like, it's yeah, from... Yeah, they stop you Apparently, from... that's what they... I forget what they're called. Something pipe. Yeah, something. Indian pipe or something. It is a difficult trail, that's for sure. You get very winded. Not a big drop if someone falls, but still a drop. Nobody wants to fall. And I put on... Today I'm wearing my gaiters. I'm not sure if you can see. And my trail runners. Because... I found that my boots really kept my foot, uh, my boot really kept my foot hot and heavy. So I bought a pair, they're not even expensive. This is a good butt exercise. That would be nice, or even this one. We're stopping and we're going to eat a plum and then we're going to continue our trail. We just came from that way. It was all 
uphill and downhill and we're going to be continuing that way. I've got salt in my eyes. I forgot I have my little... Okay guys, my daughter's getting comfortable. I should too. I can sit over here. I want to stay away from that sun. You might want to hand me that plum before I... And look, there's a mushroom right there. You see it? Oh, sorry. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm going to sit down here. Why? Because it's too sunny. Oh, I'd have to get in my bag. Eh? There's a little Rosula. Right there. Yep. I feed her a little... Yeah. Can you say I went into some water? We went into frog land. Okay, there's a road down there, but that's where the uh, four-wheelers go. And the dirt bikes. And, uh, yeah. Really nice. This side here is not as well marked as what we had so far, but there's markings everywhere. All right, guys. I'll see you in a bit. So we did end up bushwhack a little. <laughs> uh, there's a trail, believe it or not, right there. Uh, but we came to this little pit stop, cute little pit stop. Too wet to go and enjoy it, really. Too muddy, but very pretty. A little bit of water. It's always nice to see water. But this is our trail. I'm going to show you. It's basically... We're bushwhacking. There we go. A little bit of high grass. Oop. There we go. And there's a oh, it's so you can see the moisture in the air, Erica. You think so? I don't know. Yeah. It feels like just, it's so hot today, guys. I can't even tell you how hot it is. It's like 120 outside. And here we go, bushwhacking. There's our marker. What is that on the rock? Oh, look at that. That's the fungus, Erica. That's like pig's ear. Yeah. They call pig's ear. How much there is. That's crazy. Guys, we had to walk on this dirt road for a while and we weren't sure where we were going. Couldn't understand why we had to walk on a dirt road. And then finally we saw some markings and it told us, well, this is on our way back out, but we saw the markings that told us which way to go. So we are back in the woods. We are going uphill, guys. Lots of uphills. Not the, not the best path, but as expected when we're doing hikes, it won't be smooth paths all the time. We don't even know if we're going to make the whole trail today. Well, not the whole trail, to the cap. If we don't, we could always come back and do one. But we're gonna probably stop somewhere up here, have some lunch, and maybe head back. So, I'm gonna put you away for now. I'll see you in a bit. We came from all the way down there, and now we're doing some switchback. And I think this is gonna lead us to the top of the mountain, guys. So, wish us luck. I'm not going to record. We did find more chanterelles. My bag is getting bigger and bigger. Extra weight, but worth it. So, I'll see you in a bit. Erica, say hi. This is our path. It's like nuts. You can hardly see the road. Or the path. We're exhausted. 
We're either close to the top. It's so open and sunny up here. Watch your foot, Erica. Watch your footing. Whoa. This way, I'm guessing. I guess this way. Like I said, if we're not making it to the top, we're probably gonna stop, eat something, and then head back. It would be funny if we stop here. Okay, so we're not at the top yet, but look, I got lipstick all over. Yes, I hike with lipstick. Um, we stopped to eat something because we are burnt out. We've been walking a long time and we're not even at the top yet. So we took a little few minutes to put something in our belly and give us a little energy. But that's it. Mmm. So good. We just found a rock to put our butts on. But we're surrounded by bush. I'm hoping the mosquitoes won't be so vicious. So what's in my sandwich? Okay, besides my lipstick. Kind of gross, right? I was too tired to wipe it off, so here's Erica's. So what's in our sandwich? Erica, what do we have? We have some of that delicious sausage meat. We have some of my rice cheese. We have some pickles. We have tomatoes. We have some frise salad. A little bit of... Beet greens. Beet greens. Basil. Basil. Mayo. mayo. And that's it in a spinach wrap and tomatoes, yeah. So that's what we're eating. So we're going to eat our lunch and we're going to decide if we're going to keep going up. Because we're supposed to have some severe thunderstorm and we don't want to be caught in the, in the bush. And uh, we do have our rain gear, but you know, trees and, and severe weather is not the best thing. Uh, we are getting, we are having a nice sunny sunny day but we really don't want to be here if it starts raining so we're going to do our best to see if we don't make it this time right to the top we will do it another time right erica mm -hmm. yeah so and do you have any we have wi-fi yep we have wi-fi that's good we didn't even have to bring our in reach but well, it's always it good to have all the the line that's from the AT, ATV. Can yeah, answer? but you know what? That's okay. That's okay. We bring our wife, our uh, energy, anyhow, just in case we need it. God forbid we need help or something. But that's it. So I'm going to put you away for now. Hopefully this is not a goodbye till we get back. Uh, if we make it to the top, we'll show you. And if we decide to turn around, well, we'll come back another day and try to finish it. A day where we know it's not going to rain and we have more time to get back. So I'll see you in a bit, guys. As we're heading back down, as you see, we got to go way down there. Uh, we're just not going to make it before the weather changes on us. Uh, I would have loved to have made it to the 360. But you know what? Better to retrieve, be safe, than to get stuck in a pickle. We have a long ways down because we climbed up quite a bit, but we weren't even up to the cap yet. So Erica was thinking that maybe the next time, instead of heading home, we're going to, sorry, I'm trying to record and keep my balance with my sticks here. Uh, we were thinking the next time we're just going to uh, bring our tent and stop you know, have lunch and then have some, this is all downhill guys, so I'm right on the edge of a mountain here. Yeah, I'm, I'm good, Erica. Yeah, so we're thinking we're going to bring our tent next time and we'll just tent. Uh, we're going to tent and then we're going to continue our, our way, you know, even if it takes us two days to get there. Uh, but yeah, so we're going to head back now 
and I'm gonna say thanks for joining us even though it wasn't the full trip like I said I'd rather be safe and not get stuck in here with severe thunderstorms because it is crazy hot and humid we are simply drenched I couldn't even eat my lunch I ate half of it and it was just way too much for me to uh, I gotta watch my step on these rocks. Right. So anyhow, I love you guys. I'm going to talk to you maybe when I get back to the house. My Chi Chi boy must be all excited because he was so sad when he saw us leave. Because he is... I'm sure we could bring JJ next time, eh? Up here? Yeah. Well, he would, just be... he would be tired. But I'm sure he can do this, Erica. Eh? Okay, we got to go down. So I can't talk to you now, guys, because look at this. I got to go all the way down, and I don't want to break my neck. I want to go see what's up here. There's a lot of rocks up here. What is it? It's just a rocky mountain. Hey, Erica, are you coming all the way back here? Because I'm not going to continue with you. Yeah, you do need to be in shape to do this, that's for sure. So if you guys are planning to do hikes, get into shape. Do lots of walking. Comfortable shoes, number one. Uh, that's what I'm wearing. Uh, they weren't expensive, the running shoes. But they seem to be doing the trick. My foot's very comfortable, very flexible shoe. Uh, I am wearing some... Uh, some gators so I don't get any junk in my uh, there's a trail marking all the way down there I don't know if you can see it be careful Erica so we're gonna probably head home and go for another walk because my Chi Chi boy needs to go my Chi Chi boy needs to go he needs to go my baby boy he needs to go for his hikes look at those trees are all uprooted look how uprooted those trees are Either that or the whole side came down. You see that? Yeah. Okay. I can't talk to you guys now because we are going all the way down. It was a very steep way up. And I'm not going to take a chance by holding my phone and talking to you guys. Hold on, Erica. Let me put this away. Be careful, Eric. Ma? Yes. Ma? I am. Yes. Okay, guys. Love you. We'll see you soon. How funny, right? We go one way and we don't notice something. On our way back, it we feels know... It's like we're walking a different trail. It's like you're in a different trail. Yeah. Look how beautiful that is. We Mystical. Didn't notice it before. No, we didn't notice it at all. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, we're back in frog line here. Okay, guys, love you. I'll see you soon. Start working out. We have a lot of climbing in this bush. Lots of climbing. Look at that. Beautiful, though. Look how nice it is on this side of it. I just had to give you that little extra view from this side. Look at the mushrooms growing on the trees. This is really a magical place. And I'll tell you something. There's so much humidity in here. This is perfect for mushroom growing. Okay, guys. I don't want to break my neck. I got to go up here. So, I'm going to say I love you. And I'll see you on the other side.
For more videos like this, make sure to subscribe to Connie's Rawsome Kitchen. Give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends.